being ecstatic. Spike. Prepare your mic. Check on us. My dog, maybe. I don't know. Always checking on me when I'm sick. Oh, now he's gone. I better get that sheet. Oh, he's back. He likes that mirror. Take it easy. Take it easy. Yeah, I lost my shoe. My shoe's coming off. Oh, watch out, dude. And he's gone. No. It's gone now, but it'll be back. It keeps coming back. You should send that to Aunt Patty. There it goes. Yep, oh, it's back. There's the sun right there. Huh? He likes the mirror. He's gonna look in the mirror at himself. And then he goes and tells somebody, and then he comes back, I guess, because he keeps doing that and then he leaving. Does. Oh, because he's so funny. You're cute. He keeps looking himself in the mirror. Yeah. Is <laughs> that what he... Probably. Yeah, he's going to the back of it. He's like, I'm so pretty, and then he goes away, and then he comes back. God made me beautiful. Yep, now he's back. <laughs> he's like, I'm red. I'm not like all the other birds. Take, take my car. You can't take yours. <laughs> all right, well, not those. Those are my shrink wrap. We gotta list this on eBay. It's Coca-Cola Bear. Never been open. This Barbie paper doll book. This Star Wars, 35 cent Star Wars Marvel comic. This 30 cent Peter Parker Spectacular Spider Man. The Human Torch. This 15 cent DC Batman comic. The Man with Ten Eyes. This uh, Nintendo Tetris game. Pokemon cards. The sheet mold. iPhone 12 <coughs> case. And these shoes, brand new shoes, boots from Sierra. Salt and pepper shakers. And what intrigues me is the giant. You know? His head's above the clouds. See how much bigger it is than the teepee? And. This Ray Dunn. Not yours coffee cup. So that's all going on our eBay store. If you see anything you like, go over there and check it out. The other thing we got to do today is open this uh, mail we got from Handicapped Traveler, uh, Dan and Kathy. So we're going to do that next. We talked about making shoe fly pie, but it is a mix. Um, and Tammy's making a raspberry jello dessert cake. Cheesecake. Cheesecake. Uh, and I might, uh, draw, at least start drawing our granddaughter. So that might all be in this vlog. Stick around. Alright, so we got this mail from Dan and Kathy over at the Handicapped Traveler. We're gonna pop into it. We won this on a live. It's seeds, and I'm not sure if they sent us the vegetables or the flowers. Oh, look at this! Cute. Hugging horses. They're hugging. All right, so let's see what seeds. Oh, we got the flowers. Woo! -hoo! We got mammoth Russian sunflowers. I was just looking for those. Nice. We've got watermelon, crimson sweet. Beautiful. Gonna grow. We do plan on growing watermelon. We're getting some watermelon from another friend of ours too. That's stay tuned to check that out. 
all that stuff will probably be on our Scrappy Acres channel, so you probably have to go over there to check it out. And we got double curled parsley. Very cool. And we've never grown parsley. I do like it as a uh, lots of different stuff. Parsley is good for a lot of different things. Jeff and Tammy, awkward hug. Seriously, thank you so much. Thank you so much for all for all the two of you do and the support you give us. Hope you can use these seeds. God bless, Dan, Kathy, and Lucy. And Lucy. Thanks, And guys. I spelled it right. It is with a K. So very cool. Love it. We'll Hallmark. definitely use these seeds. Hallmark card. That is a wonderful. And I love the hug and awkward hug horses. Oh, there's a big awkward hug. All right, we got some more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. All right, so we're gonna attempt to make a shoe fly pie. Tammy was gonna make a, what was it called? Raspberry something cake? A raspberry jello cake with cream cheese. She will be making it later. Our daughter's sick now. She's gonna come and help her make it. She's getting that stuff that's going around. But we're gonna make this from a mix. We got this at a Amish store. It's made by the Good Company, Golden Barrel. And it does say on the back, you can visit them at www.goldenbarrel.com. Uh, they do make a high fructose corn syrup, but they also make table syrup, corn syrup, pancake and waffle syrup, sorghum syrup, invert sugar, unsulfured baking molasses, unsulfured blackstrap molasses, funnel cake mix, shoe fly cake mix, which is a shoe fly pie, pancake waffle mix, fondant, oils they have are corn, coconut, cottonseed, peanut, vegetable, canola, oil, olive, and oil blends. They have dry sugars, raw, EFG sugar, light and dark brown sugar, and they have Mrs. Scholler's products, which includes ham glaze and turkey syrup. Turkey syrup. But today we're trying the Golden Barrel Pennsylvania Dutch Old Fashioned Shoe Fly Pie, which is basically just molasses and corn syrup. Um, you do have to have a crust or make a crust. The <laughs> ingredients for the dry mix is enriched bleach flour. Wheat flour, vegetable shortening, dried vegetable shortening, and then the syrup has corn syrup, water, molasses, invert sugar, and caramel color. So, baking directions say follow three simple steps. Pour the contents of the syrup jar into a mixing bowl, we have here. Place the jar in hot water for easy pouring. Let's open this up and see what's in here. There's a dry mix bag. Best Buy 12824. So we got till the end of this year, but molasses. We bought this quite a while ago, maybe a year ago. I feel like it's been a year. And this is good till 12, 12, 8, 24. So it lasts quite a while. Now the instructions say pour contents of syrup jar into the mixing bowl. And then place jar in hot water for easy pouring. Oh, so we're gonna place this jar into the hot water for easy pouring. Hot water. I'll let that sit. I think it's got a seal on it. Yeah. So we'll put this lid back on. Just lay this down in this hot water. And then after a little bit, we're going to add one cup of hot water. Stir well until well blended. Add one and a half cups of the crumb from the box and stir gently, but don't beat it. Let it stand 10 minutes or longer while preparing the pastry. Which we're just using these homemade or store bought pastries. We're going to preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and we're going to prepare one 9 inch or two 7 inch deep pastry shell. So we're going to do one 9 inch with Tammy's mom's pie dish, right? No, this is uh, Karen, my babysitter. She babysat me for my childhood and this is her. Hi, Dish. And her husband just passed away. 
Uh, we're going to stir the mixture again to remove settling crumbs from the bottom and pour into an unbaked shell, sprinkling the remaining crumbs evenly, evenly over top. We're going to bake in the oven at 350 degrees for one hour or until golden brown. And then if you want a less gooey bottom, you can use three quarter cups of the syrup and then add a half a cup plus one tablespoon of hot water. So less water. But we're going to just, I like gooey bottoms. All right. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Shoe fly, don't. Timmy's preparing the pastry. She's got this greased and she's gonna roll out this pre made hot Cheat. dough. Cheat. So what? what was left that they say to add on top we did add some brown sugar which is absolutely crazy nut wads but we added brown sugar and butter to this topping so it's going to turn into a crumb. you know candified crumb delicious yummy can't wait to eat this topping shoot shoe fly shoot it says after 10 minutes to give this a nice little stir. So there it is, one hour. We're gonna let it cool, harden up a little bit. It's still pretty soft. Supper, we're just gonna add some hamburgers. We're gonna put them on toast, toasted bread, mushrooms, and onions. Probably some gouda cheese too, and then we're gonna have this rice side nor mushroom. And we're gonna make these. Now, these don't taste like regular potatoes, but these taste like really good. Uh, instant potatoes so if you're going for real potatoes just get a real potato but if you're going for you if you want some really good instant potatoes this is your jam right here so for our burger tonight we take some toast that we made into garlic toast put on aioli garlic spread we put on the burger with the melted gouda and the mushrooms and onions cut it in half and bam this is so good then we'll go ahead and throw on a side of them baby reds with some butter and salt and pepper and some of that mushroom rice. Mmm, it's going to be such a good meal. Alright guys, so we got our shoe fly pie here. Look at this. Look how dark that is. Really dark molasses. Looks so good. I'm looking forward to this. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Better not touch my shoe fly pie. Mmm. What would you say that tastes like? Good. Brown sugar. Brown sugar and good. Just goodness. Rick Flair shirt. Woo! To be a man, you gotta beat the man. Woo! Woo! Yeah. It's different. Mmm. I'll eat all my stuff. 
Keep finding the art and everything. We'll see you guys next time.